James Webb Space Telescope 7 New Images from Deep Space, 4K Resolution Set your sights on the cosmos and prepare to be captivated. The James Webb Space Telescope has recently unveiled seven new images that beckon us to explore the universe's uncharted territories, from distant galaxies to intricate nebulae. These snapshots open doors to mysteries, inviting us to question what lies beyond our earthly realm. Each picture is a visual marvel, and a riddle piques the curiosity of astronomers and stargazers alike. Are you ready to journey into the cosmos? The splendors of space are now just a glimpse away, and the adventure promises to be nothing short of mesmerizing. 1. The Ring Nebula, a cosmic masterpiece. The Ring Nebula paints an intriguing portrait in the vast canvas of space. Located in the constellation Lyra and known to astronomers as M57 or NGC 6720, this planetary nebula tells a rich tale of cosmic life and death. Despite its name, a planetary nebula has nothing to do with planets. It's a cloud of gas and dust created when a star is similar to our sun, but nearing the end of its life, expels its outer layers. When a star runs out of fuel, these outer layers are cast off, leaving behind a core that continues to heat the surrounding ejected material. This creates an eye-catching formation that we see as a nebula. The Ring Nebula is near in astronomical terms, sitting at a distance of 2,300 light-years from Earth. If you were to travel at the speed of light, it would take you 2,300 years to get there. Its dimensions span 2.14 x 2.17 arc minutes, a unit of measurement for celestial objects, giving it a ring-like appearance. The James Webb Space Telescope has recently provided us with an extraordinary view of the Ring Nebula, a picture filled with details never seen before. The telescope's near-infrared camera managed to capture a crisp image that allows us to explore the nebula's hidden depths. What are the unique features we can spot? First, we notice the filament structure of the inner ring, something like threads woven in space. It's an intricate pattern that speaks to the complex processes at work when stars shed their skins. Around 20,000 dense globules fill the nebula, loaded with molecular hydrogen, a raw and abundant form of the element often present in space. Contrastingly, the inner region of the nebula shows signs of scorching gas. The main shell of the nebula contains a thin ring of emissions from carbon-based molecules known as polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons, PAAs. PAAs are complex molecules on Earth, such as car exhaust and grilled food. A series of roughly 10 concentric arcs lie just outside the main ring. These are believed to result from the interaction of the central star with a low-mass companion star orbiting at a distance comparable to that between the Earth and Pluto. Imagine two dance partners in space, their interaction leaving behind these traces. In unraveling the mysteries of the Ring Nebula, astronomers are engaging in celestial detective work. They analyze the nebula to learn more about the star that gave birth to it, akin to cosmic archaeology uncovering clues about the past through the nebula's present structure. The exploration of the Ring Nebula offers not just a visual treat, but a deep insight into the workings of our universe. Isn't it fascinating to think that the death of a star can create such a complex and telling piece of cosmic art? What else might be hiding in the far reaches of our universe, waiting to tell us its story? 2. Webb observes a sparkling globular cluster. Imagine looking into the night sky and seeing thousands of stars shining thousands of times brighter than the stars in our atmosphere. That's a glimpse into the world of Messier 92, and 92, a globular star cluster situated in the constellation Hercules, a staggering 26,700 light-years away from us. A globular cluster is a spherical collection of tightly packed stars, and N92 is one such celestial jewel box filled with about 300,000 stars in a ball just 100 light-years across. Recently, the James Webb Space Telescope fixed its eyes on this celestial spectacle for just over an hour, unveiling previously hidden details. The primary focus of this particular program is on resolved stellar populations like M92. Webb's ability to identify individual stars within clusters like this is vital to understanding the physics of stars and galaxies. The project also helps improve the telescope's calibration, making the measurements as accurate as possible. Why did the team choose to observe N92 specifically? There's more to this cluster than meets the eye. N92 is a reference in studies of stellar systems due to its age, ranging between 12 and 13 billion years old, making it one of the oldest, if not the oldest, globular clusters in the Milky Way. 
M92's density, thousands of times denser than the region around the sun, provides an opportunity to test how WET performs in such a lush environment. Webb's operation at longer wavelengths allows it to observe very cool, low-mass stars, some close to the boundary where stars cease to be stars and become brown dwarfs. Webb's near-infrared camera has two modules with a chip gap between them. The highly crowded and bright center of N92 would have limited the data's usefulness, but the positioning of these images aligns well with existing Webb data. The image captured by Webb's NIRCOM shows a field of view that covers a space about nine light-years across, highlighting the tightly packed stars of N92. Observing a globular cluster like N92 is like uncovering a treasure trove of knowledge about stars' behavior, evolution, and interaction with the night sky. What other wonders could be hiding within this dense cluster? What stories can these ancient stars, packed closely together, tell us about our universe? The James Webb Space Telescope's observation of N92 is just a starting point, a teaser of the endless mysteries waiting to be explored in the vast cosmos. 3. Exploring NGC 346, a dynamic cluster of stars in nebulosity. The universe is filled with breathtaking sights, and NGC 346 is no exception. Nestled within the constellation of Tucana, NGC 346 is a lively and bustling region teeming with activity at 200,000 light-years from Earth. This star cluster, revealed through the keen eyes of NASA's James Webb Space Telescope near-infrared camera, lies within a nebula in the small Magellanic Cloud, a dwarf galaxy close to our Milky Way. The image spans approximately 3.9 arc minutes or 240 light-years across, capturing an impressive field of view. But what makes NGC 346 so fascinating and what are these vibrant colors we're seeing? The image showcases the presence of more building blocks than we had initially expected for stars and planets. It consists of clouds rich in dust and hydrogen, the essential ingredients for forming celestial bodies. These clouds are colored in intriguing hues, reflecting two distinct types of hydrogen gas. The pink gas in the image is sulfur-rich hydrogen, while the cyan color represents nitrogen-rich hydrogen. The Webb Telescope's near-infrared camera can discern these specific wavelengths of light, allowing us to distinguish between the two types of hydrogen. The most prominent feature within NGC 346 is a star cluster, home to many young and massive stars. The intense radiation and powerful winds from these stars sculpt the surrounding gas and dust into intricate shapes, visible in the image as filaments and pillars. These structures are more than just cosmic eye candy. They are also the birthplaces of new stars. One can see a broad, dark lane snaking through the image. This dark line is a region of dust blocking the light from the stars behind it, creating a stark contrast between the bright, colorful surroundings and the inky blackness. These dust lanes and filaments intertwine, creating a mesmerizing light and shadow dance. The James Webb Space Telescope's ability to capture the beauty and complexity of NGC 346 showcases its incredible precision and power. With this newfound insight, astronomers can study the processes of star formation, the interactions between massive stars and their surroundings, and the chemistry of the interstellar medium. Each aspect of NGC 346's image holds clues to the giant cosmic puzzle, helping us understand the life cycle of stars and the dynamic nature of our universe. 4. Webb peers into the Orion Nebula's stellar nursery. The universe is brimming with places of birth and rebirth, and one of the most iconic cosmic cradles is the Orion Nebula. This nebula is a wellspring of young stars and planetary systems located in the famous Orion constellation. At a relatively close distance of about 1,350 light-years from Earth, the Orion Nebula is a fascinating laboratory for studying star formation processes. The James Webb Space Telescope recently turned its attention to this stellar nursery, capturing an astonishing image that reveals the nebula's inner workings in unprecedented detail. The image spans about 4.4 arc minutes, equivalent to roughly one-fifteenth of the diameter of the Moon as observed from Earth. Despite its relatively small size in the night sky, the Orion Nebula is an astronomical wonderland. Young stars are born within this vibrant cosmic cloud, and planets take shape. What do we see in this image? The various colors reflect different temperatures and physical conditions within the nebula. The warm reddish areas indicate the presence of ionized hydrogen gas, where young and massive stars emit intense ultraviolet radiation, 
causing the gas to glow. The cooler bluish regions represent dust particles and more excellent gas. These areas are often the sites where new stars and planetary systems are forming. One of the most striking features in the image is the Pillars of Creation, a name that evokes both wonder and curiosity. These towering columns of gas and dust are iconic and have been imaged before, but Webb's infrared capabilities reveal even more detail. The pillars are regions where the star formation process is actively taking place. The intense radiation from nearby massive stars erodes the surrounding material, sculpting these breathtaking structures. In their shadowy depths, new leads and planetary systems are emerging. The Orion Nebula image captured by Webb serves as a testament to the telescope's extraordinary capabilities. By peering into the heart of this stellar nursery, astronomers gain insights into the earliest stages of star and planet formation. They can study the physical processes, the interplay of radiation and matter, and the dynamics of this bustling cosmic neighborhood. The Orion Nebula is a crucible of creation, and Webb's observations provide us with a front row seat to this celestial spectacle. 5. Webb's Cosmic Canvas, a glimpse into the early universe. The James Webb Space Telescope has embarked on an awe-inspiring journey to unravel the mysteries of the early universe. In its quest to peer back in time, Webb had captured a mesmerizing image that provides a glimpse into the universe's infancy, a time when galaxies began forming and stars ignited like cosmic fireworks. This captivating image, the Hubble Deep Field, was obtained during Webb's early release science program. It offers a stunning view of a tiny patch of the sky that appears empty to the naked eye, but teens with celestial wonders. To understand the significance of this image, we must journey back in time, approximately 13.5 billion years, to a universe that was only about 250 million years old. This universe is in its infancy, a cosmic toddler taking its first steps. The light from the galaxies in this image has traveled for billions of years to reach us, offering a precious glimpse into the past. The Hubble Deep Field showcases a treasure trove of galaxies, each a galaxy unto itself. These galaxies, though small and faint in appearance, are the building blocks of the universe as we know it today. They represent the seas from which the grand cosmic structures of the modern universe would eventually emerge. What's particularly striking is the absence of large mature galaxies in this image. Instead, we see countless small, irregularly shaped objects. These are the progenitors of galaxies, the precursors to the majestic spiral and elliptical galaxies we see today. The James Webb Space Telescope's ability to peer into the early universe is a testament to human curiosity and ingenuity. It allows us to explore a cosmic era that was previously beyond our reach, shedding light on the origins of galaxies, stars, and the very fabric of our universe. As we gaze upon the Hubble Deep Field, we're not just observing distant galaxies, but looking back in time and witnessing the universe's formative years. It's a humbling and awe-inspiring experience that reminds us of the vastness and complexity of the cosmos. With each new image and discovery, the James Webb Space Telescope continues to rewrite our cosmic history and inspire us to keep exploring the boundless wonders of the universe. 6. The Stunning Veil Nebula A Cosmic Ghost Unveiled Prepare to be transported to the realm of celestial artistry, where the James Webb Space Telescope unveils the intricate beauty of the Veil Nebula. This cosmic masterpiece, the Cygnus Loop, resides in the constellation Cygnus, approximately 1,470 light-years away from Earth. Its delicate, wispy tendrils stretch across the sky, weaving a mesmerizing tapestry of stellar destruction and rebirth. The Veil Nebula is the remnants of a massive star that meant an explosive end in a supernova explosion. This event, which occurred some 8,000 years ago, as observed from Earth, expelled the star's outer layers into space, creating the intricate lacework of gas and dust that we see today. The resulting nebula is divided into several segments, with the West Veil, East Veil, and Pickering's Triangle being the most prominent. The James Webb Space Telescope recently captured a portion of the Veil Nebula with its near-infrared camera, NIRCM, unveiling a level of detail and clarity never before seen. This image showcases the delicate filamentous structures of the nebula, each thread a tapestry of cosmic forces at play. The Veil Nebula is a testament to the universe's capacity for destruction and creation. In its violent demise, the star seeded the surrounding space with heavy elements forged in its core, elements that would eventually become the building blocks of new leads, planets, and even life. 
It's a cosmic cycle that reminds us of the interconnectedness of the cosmos. Studying the Veil Nebula with the James Webb Space Telescope allows astronomers to delve into its chemical composition, interactions with the interstellar medium, and the formation of new stars within its gossamer embrace. Every observation adds a piece to the puzzle of cosmic evolution. As we contemplate the ethereal beauty of the Veil Nebula, we are reminded that the universe is not static, but in a perpetual dance of change and transformation. It's a reminder that, like the stars themselves, we are stardust, forged in the hearts of ancient celestial giants. The James Webb Space Telescope's ability to capture such celestial wonders ignites our curiosity and exploration of the cosmos. 7. Webb's Cosmic Eye Peering into the Helix Nebula prepare to gaze into the cosmic eye of the Helix Nebula, an intricate and mesmerizing region of our Milky Way galaxy. Situated roughly 700 light-years away from Earth in the constellation Aquarius, this celestial spectacle is a planetary nebula, a cloud of gas and dust expelled by a dying star. The Helix Nebula is often called the Eye of God or the Eye of Sauron due to its striking appearance. At its center lies a dying star, shedding its outer layers in a beautiful display of cosmic recycling. These expelled layers form intricate structures illuminated by the intense radiation from the central star. The result is a hypnotic, eye-like appearance that captures the imagination. Webb's image of the Helix Nebula delves into the intricate details of this stellar remnant. With its near-infrared camera, NRCM, the telescope penetrates the shroud of dust and gas, revealing the inner workings of the nebula. The image showcases complex structures, concentric rings, and faint tendrils of material, each telling a story of the star's life and death. Astronomers study planetary nebulae like the Helix Nebula to understand the late stages of stellar evolution better. These objects offer insights into the fate of stars like our Sun, which will one day undergo this transformation. They help us comprehend the recycling of elements in the cosmos, as the expelled material from dying stars enriches the interstellar medium, providing the raw materials for future generations of stars and planetary systems. We're reminded of the universe's interconnectedness as we peer into the Helix Nebula's cosmic eye. Stars are born, live, and die, and in their final moments, they contribute to creating new celestial bodies. It's a profound reminder of the ever-changing nature of the cosmo. I hope you liked the video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.